Hello everybody. Well, we have achieved a uh, about a five, exactly a five foot foot extension to our six by 10 foot deck. It's now six by 15 feet and uh, actually came out quite nice. It was a little tricky marrying the two sides because we weren't anticipating the extension, but over the top of this entire deck from that little crook there, all the way to the end will be a six foot by 10 foot by eight foot high screened enclosure that we're going to be doing right after the first of the year. Maybe even a little sooner. I'll design that. It's actually already done. But uh, it was a lot of fun, actually almost like building a second whole deck. Trickiest thing was marrying the two end pieces. And there's only two ways you can do it. Uh, one is to take off the other boards, cut a 45 on both sides, and then slide them underneath, underneath each other. That's probably the best way, but then you get a lot of splintering on the uh, thin ends. Or, as you can see, we put in a one by spline that runs the entire length of the deck, very carefully uh, leveled to make sure that the left side was accurate with the right side. And then when we added the new boards, I added some shims, although I really didn't need it. There underneath, uh, to the right of that shim, is or spline, is another 2 by 6 by 8 board, joist board. So those end pieces are nailed to it, and they are absolutely perfectly level with both sides. They'll shrink a little bit, but that will actually make them comply with the other side, which has already been up for about 6 months now, or maybe even a little bit more. But uh, I think it looks pretty good. Uh, it's about uh, 330. It's about 80 degrees out here and there's the entire whoops the entire length of the deck. Sorry about that. And you can see that the boards line up quite nicely. Obviously the spaces between this side have not shrunk yet. They will match almost perfectly for all that matters. Uh, the other side which has had a chance to shrink. They shrink about 5% maybe even a little bit less but it came out quite nice. I uh, put on two new piers, one there, 30 inch ground spike, 30 inch ground spike, a four by four with four bolts on either side. Those are through bolts, so it's not going anywhere. Absolutely perfectly level with the other side. Uh, rock solid, so it should house the, uh, the six by 10 uh, by eight foot high screen enclosure quite nicely. Uh, you can see we now have that floating dock that's over there. And uh, things are shaping up quite nicely. This is the last of the big projects that we have, but uh, I think it was well worth it. And I'll jump up here a little bit. And it'll be quite nice to have all the bugs away. By the way, uh, on that, to the right of the spline, to the west of the sp spline, underneath the deck boards is screening and or screening screening that we use to keep the bugs from coming from underneath uh, it's tacked all the way around so it's impossible for any bugs to get through and we'll be adding screening underneath here as well from that little angle over to the spline it's actually not that hard to do uh, but uh, hopefully it will work out quite nice so there is the new 6 by 15 foot deck and waiting for its 16, 6 by 10 foot screen enclosure. There's our two Cialis chairs. Uh, we couldn't support, afford the bathtub, so use your imagination. Ah, bye.